ಭಕ್ತಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಾಮಿನಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಲೀಲಾ ಕಥಾನೆ ಸುಧಾಕ್ಷ ಮೌಢಾರ್ಯ ಮಾಧು ಸಂಯುಕ್ತ ವರಂವರೇಣ್ಯ ಪುರುಷ ಮಹಾಂತ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಶಿರಸಾನ್ ತ್ರಿದಾಂಡಿ ನಾಂ ಭಕ್ತ ಶಿರೋಮಣಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪಾದ ವ್ಯವಸಾಯಿಕ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಲೀಲಾಮೃತ ಸಾರಸಾರ ಜೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶ್ರೀವಾಸಾದಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಗೌರವ ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ ಹರೆ ವಂಚಕಲ್ಪತರು ಕೃಪಾ ಸಿಂಧು ದೇವ ಪತಿತ ಪಾವನೆ ವೈಷ್ಣವ Today is our Thursday question and answers. Um, and tomorrow is uh, Purnima. Um, Sri Vishwarup Mahasava. Friday, 29th September, almost the end of September. And today, Namaja is Radha Stakur's disappearance day. And yesterday was the appearance day of Shila Bhakti Mahas Stakur. Amazing. So, yesterday was the Bhaktivna Stakur's appearance day. Today, Nama Jaira Stakur's disappearance day. Tomorrow is the Vishyurup Mahasava Purnima. That is the middle of the Chaturmar. Two months is over. Now two more months. One more month, then afterwards Karthik begins. So, um, but actually it is more than it is 3 about 3 months since chaturmasya started because we had one extra month in between after 15 days we had one month extra so but however tomorrow is purnima Sri Vishwarup Mahasa. So Chaitanya Mahaprabhu he had an elder brother, Vishwarup. Actually, Balaram. He was very dear to Advaita Acharya. Advaita Acharya was usually discussed with him. This whole world is, people are not interested in spiritual life. It is so amazing, even today, uh, you know, it's, uh, sometimes you wonder, you know, 
sometimes um, is also astonishing the power of Krishna's external potential. That's why unless one has sadhu sangha, mahas sadhu sangha, even in very short time, you know, you know, will not go away. Because Maya, external energy of Krishna is so powerful, very deluding. Who can, who can stop that? Who can overcome the deluding energy? Only a pure devotee who is, who can see Maya, everything. No. Who can feel and he can see Maya, external potency of Krishna. Only when we come in such a, even a short time, with that personality, who can see this external energy of Krishna, then they can empower us, same way to not get influenced. Otherwise, Amen. You know, Krishna's external potency is no less powerful than himself. Um, but it cannot work in his presence. Like the darkness, in the presence of sunlight, you know, it cannot hold water. So in the presence of Krishna, presence of the holy name, presence of pure devotees, uh, you know, it cannot hold water. Like, for example, we can see the life of Arjas Thakur disappearing day to day. How oh, one time, see in Bhagavatam, second canto, uh, Kapila is telling mother. Devaruti, the power of, the leading power of Krishna in the form of a female can delude big, big kings, you know, blink up their eyes, you know. You can see uh, so many stories, so many incidences. Vishwamitra, great saint, great Tapasvi. Huh? Ah. So that is the is telling power. Even as a Mohini Avatara, no? ah. Lord Himself came as a Mohini. And even Lord Shiva couldn't have a chance. <laughs> so, but Aridas Thakur, what happened? When Aridas Thakur uh, he says, uh, What happened? Uh, There was a Ramchandra Khan. He was very envious. When uh, Aridas Thakur uh, 
was in Benapol. Was there, he was simply chanting his three lakh name, and there was one landlord, Ramchandra Kham, very envious. People used to give respect to Aridas Thakur, he could not tolerate it, became very, very envious. This is a thing, you know, when you become envious of anyone, especially Vaishnavas, that is down, you know. So, uh, I am so rich, I am so much land. Why nobody is giving respect? Where are this person? Doesn't have anything. Plus, he's a Muslim, born in Muslim. And they're giving so much respect, he could not tolerate. So, he said, you, you, you should bring bad name to Arigastha. So, he tried so many ways, trying to find fault. Could not find any fault. People used to go and hear Arikata and then chanting is to come back. Then he took shelter of, he brought prostitutes. There was one very beautiful prostitute, very young, Lakshahira, huh? name was Lakshahira. Uh, he said, I will give a lot of money if he can uh, somehow bring bad name. Huh? Oh, no, no problem. Three days, give me three days. I'll finish his character. So, now that's how the prostitutes are. You know, money selling their body. Now this is why. So, um, she agreed and then Ramchandra Khan sent her huh, a lot of money. And he said, I will send some, like a sipai, meaning like a police, like a, who can catch both of them together. <laughs> she said, no, 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 let, let, let I control Aridas Thakur. Then you can bring your security person. Ah, uh, so I desire you destroy his Vairagya Dharma, you know, his renunciation, you know, that Aridas Thakur is followed. So, all right. So, uh, first night she entered, very beautiful. Uh, making all this thing. But somehow there was a Tulsi there and then she paid obeisances to Tulsi and then to uh, somehow Aridas Thakur also. And then uh, So, uh, so by somehow our good fortune, see, was paying obeisances to Tulsi and to Param Vaishnava. See, so already our Sukriti, you know, Bhakti started. <laughs> so she does not know. So, uh, unknowingly, you know. That's why the tradition, you know, if you respect tradition, great Vaishnavas going down, you know, even though you are so down, but still those things uh, may appear like insignificant, bring so much fortune in one's life. Huh? Then, then she desired is. Oh, you know, he looks so young. And actually, Aridas Thakur was very young. Huh? Uh, he appeared 35 years before Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. 
And when this happened, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu had not yet appeared. He was probably mid twenties, mid twenties. So um, then, oh, you look nice, so young. You should enjoy, you know. Uh, oh, without your association, being touch with you, I will not. I will die. I'll give up my life. This is what crush is telling. Okay, <laughs> middle of the night, and. Aridas Thakur alone is young, understand? Bah! What the test? And Aridas Thakur, he gave a assurance, all right, please, he listen to me. I will accept your proposal. But I have one problem. I have been chanting one. Uh, one crore, you know, three lakhs. Three lakhs, right? End of this month coming, one crore is coming. And I'm very close. Please, that's why. Give me a chance. Let me complete my quota of chanting. Then I will guarantee, fulfill your desire. But how loaded this answer is. And uh, because he did not, Another possibility is scold her, they, that, you, they, they, no, get out. But he did not say that. He was very respectful. You know, Aridas Thakur was respectful to her. And he accepted her proposal. That's another thing, amazing, you know. I will fulfill your desire of enjoying. All right. But let me finish my commitment to the Lord. See, there is so much we can learn from this, you know, in Syria. So then, then, uh, Now, why he is telling that? I will fulfill your desire, but you wait. Let me finish. Maybe by end of the day, night, I will finish. So that means he is telling you, please listen to Arinam. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, huh? the important limb of bhakti is Shravana. You know, you listen. Please listen. Huh? Sit down and listen. Huh? I'll fulfill your desire. So, actually, her desire is there, her soul's desire is pure, okay? Like anybody else. Actually, everybody's desire is pure, okay? <laughs> but when it comes down to outside world, it may appear bad, but inside it is pure. It is Atma's vritti, you know. Love for the Supreme Lord is there. Attraction is there. You cannot. And whatever our attraction to anything of this world is that perturbation or uh, uh, you know wrong, transformation. You know, of that pure love, pure attraction to the Lord. You know, whatever attachment or love towards of this mundane world attachment, there is no love actually. <laughs> you know, if you are attracted to certain things, attachment or, you know, hatred, for example, so called lewdness, love, you know, mundane love. Kama, Prodha, huh? Loba, Moha, Madha, Masarya. You understand all this? All these are all basically transformation of that pure love towards Krishna. You know, Anuraga. 
the jiva has that you love towards the Lord. That is getting transformed into the so much filthy, you know, these things in this world. So, similarly, this prostitutes enjoying, proposing is also that pure love. Now, who recognized it? Who can recognize it? Vaishnava, pure Vaishnava. Aridas Thakur is, hey, he is after all telling the truth. You see, she is telling the truth. So, I will definitely fulfill her desire. Our desire is what? Serve the Lord. So please sit down and hear the Lord's name, Shravana. You know, please hear. So, so he is not telling anything bad. And he respected her. So that is the one thing. You know, she also respected him, paying obeisances and Tulsi. So it is like you can see the transformation. But Amazing. That's why the very sight of a Tulusi or a pure devotee, that is the beginning of the entire change. You understand? You can see in our life. Then, that's why the, you know, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's instruction. Respect, without expecting any respect. Kirtaniya hmm? Sadhari. You know, lower than the blade of grass, more taller than tree. You know, see, all these. So, uh, then what happened? First night, then the sunrise came, sunset, then Aridas Thakur asking for it, please, you know. I tried my best, I could not finish my. Surely, huh, tomorrow, huh, I will finish it tomorrow. So come back evening again. You know. He encouraged her to come. Then again she came. Again he said, ask forgiveness, please, you know, I have this obligation. Surely I will fulfill, I will finish and I will fulfill your desire. So second day left. Then third day, what happened? Third night. Uh, see the power as she is hearing the Naam. See, this is churning, removing all the dirt, many, many lifespans. She, not, she was not prostitute for one life, okay? Many, many lives. Actually, all of us like that, you know. Prostitution means what? Don't, you know. You feel, if our consciousness attracted to other than Krishna or Guru Vaishnava, we are prostitute. You know, it's simple. We are all prostituted in one cell. Maybe sometime, maybe not sometime. You get the pardon? In real sense. Because Krishna is our original, you know, our mula, as band, or you know, we are our master, lover. Or, so other than him, if I show our love or anything anywhere else, not related to Krishna, then we are prostitutes. So, of course, this is in a mundane world. You know? uh, technically. So, what happened third day? Then she started hearing and hearing. Uh, then uh, then
अर्जाज टाकूर नाम आई कमिंग आउट एंड दिस प्रॉस्टिट्यूट इज यू नो शी इज लिजनिंग so unknowingly she started following this kirtan rupi bhajana anga and unknowingly she started attracting then our consciousness started clear, clearing then having the <coughs> so darshan of vaishnava paying obeisances to tulsi taking darshan of vaishnava and paying obeisances to vaishnava then hearing pure naam from the pure vaishnava uh, then coming to be vaishnavas you know sadhana place bhajan stala Uh, uh, to stay a few time, you know, sometime there. So the the fruit of all that is the Arinam started dancing on her tongue. Uh, then, as soon as the morning started, then. something happened inside her uh then uh then she she started telling you know i came with such a bad intention to bring bad name to, because i was being sent i was being agent ramchandra khan wanted to bring very bad name to you then um, arudas thakur said i knew all these things <laughs> you know and she asked forgiveness you know don't worry i stayed back to deliver you you know otherwise i would have left 3 days ago i would have left this place but i stayed back now what should i do he said then go whatever money you have acquired with so you know with all these bad things we give it to the brahmanas you know don't keep anything with you then you come so she distributed to all the brahmana she shaved on her head and one cloth wearing she came and arida stakur uh you know initiated her in the holy name then she is wondering now how i'm going to lead my life don't worry krishna will take care of you you worship tulsi and then chant nothing else so see the association of arinas takur by by imagine transformation drastic how long 3 days you know she became a famous vaishnavi great vaishnavas is to is to come and take a darshan but you see that is the possibility you know turning somebody a prostitute into great vaishnavi but Aridhi and Aridha Stakur was not taking any credit for him for that. 
He was humble. He said, "This is the power of holy name. I am nothing. No. I was only the instrument, useless instrument. You know. And usually, people get other way around by associating or even looking at a prostitute. They will." <laughs> Hit the ground, but here no. But he, he was able to transform. But that is the uh, power. You know? That's why try to we should understand the power of the holy name. You know? biggest power in the world. Okay. When I was being consultant, it years on, you know, they, I was also chanting. The Pentagon people telling, all around you there is an invisible field more powerful than a nuclear bomb. Okay, scientists actually watch for it. If we chant one hour, it gives us seven hours of deep sleep rest. You know, scientifically they have studied. So they, we have equipped with so much power, so much wealth. So we should realize, and we realize by hearing the great sadhus, you know, like especially Arigastha. Then not only that, uh, uh, there is an another incidence of Aridas Thakur. Uh, about, uh, forty. Modified. Maya Devi. Uh, in, our, <laughs> in a long time. Uh, Jiva Mohini, Sakshat Maya Devi, that's very good. Sakshat. So one day, what happened? Um, Arda Stakur was in his cave, you know, he was deeply immersed in chanting. Huh? Then the night was very like a bright moon. Huh? Uh, because of the moon everywhere, all ten directions, very pure, very beautiful light. Huh? Uh, then the light, moonlight falling on the waves of the Ganga. You know, you can see the waves going up and down very beautifully. Uh, then near the cave, um, uh, Tulsi was there, you know, hanging. Huh? Uh, then Looking at the beauty of the cave, people used to get charmed. Huh? Then, at that time, Mana Mohini, Mana Mohini, meaning one who can enchant the mind and very beautiful lady, she came there. Uh, Then our 
coming already it was very beautiful okay moonlight and all that coming her even made it more very attractive very beautiful so the 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 scent coming from our body uh, was spreading all around ten directions uh, and she was you know very beautifully decorated with so many uh, amazing <clears throat> ornaments you know then she was very enchanting uh, uh, he was able to attract anybody huh? so that mohini you know mo mohini you know mohini one who enchants any mind huh? so slowly slowly uh, she also paid obeisances to tulsi <laughs> And she also did Tulsi Parikrama and then she entered the cave. <laughs> uh, then uh, she is telling, uh, closing her hands. Uh, At the door itself, she paid obeisances to Aridas Thakur. Then, then, at the entry itself, with Veena, huh? it can, or so enchanting voice, right? Even it can defeat, um, you know, there's a one musical instrument called Veena. Huh? Uh, I don't know what it's called in English. Veena. Huh? I think you must have heard. It can even defeat Veena. Huh? Oh, Arida, she's saying. You are the <clears throat> Jagat Ke Bandhu. You are a relative of the whole world. And then very beautiful, and so much qualities we have. By looking at your beauty and your qualities, I've been enchanted. Uh, I've come with the desire to have your association. I've come under your shelter. Please have mercy on me. Please accept me. Uh, uh, giving uh, shelter, showing compassion on others is the one of the quality of a sadhu. Uh, so, say saying to bring out, you know, to bring out karma, you know, lust in Aridas Taku, she is making all this, you know, like movements. Huh? Uh, uh, if uh, anyone looks at it, even big, big <clears throat> tapasvis will fall. You know, like the other, other time you said, even uh, any big rishis you know, who are doing tapasya, austerity, thousands of years, they will still fall down. So like that, uh, Gambir Achal. But in the mind of Aridas Thakur, nothing happened. You know, no Vikara, like a study, not any uh, disturbance at all, not even a trace of it uh, happened in his, in his mind. But rather, he started feeling compassion on her. Then, then very sweetly, Aridas Thakur is telling, 
have taken a vow, have taken a, this Nama Sankirtan Maha Yajna. I am conducting this Yajna, Nama Sankirtan, you know. I am offering Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare. Continuous. See, usually in the fire sacrifice, right? As a fire is going on, we are keep offering something, right? In the same way, Nam Sankirtan Yajna, what is happening? He is offering the Nam, okay? Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram. And where is throwing, putting that Nam into the ear, understand? Ear is also like a Kunda, it's going and falling, the sound falling. That's why we have to say and hear. Then it is like a yajna, maha yajna, huh? nama sankirtan yajna. You know, nitya prati, non stop. I am taking a diksha. Wow, that continuously I will keep on doing this yajna, non stop. Usually, yajna cannot be stopped, huh? certain duration. Huh? So, till my sankhya, my taken a vow, Till I complete, I cannot do any work. This is my commitment. So now, today, till now, I'm not able to complete the Nama Sankhya, you know, my quota. Huh? The thing I was committed to do, I'm not yet able to complete it. Uh, please sit down. And soon I will finish. Huh? As soon as I finish my round, my commitment, I will fulfill your desire. So telling, so nicely, Arjuna Thakur, he started chanting. Are Krishna, Are Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Are Are Ram, 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 Are Krishna, Are Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Are Ram, Ram, Ram. So all night went away. Then when the morning came, then the lady got up and went. So like that, three days, three nights, huh? uh, you know, it, it happened. Even actually it says, our Acharya, even Brahma's mind could have been blown away. Huh? She was so beautiful. Maya Devi, you know. Then, then what happened? Oh. It's like our Acharya is saying, in front of Aridas Thakur, showing all these things. Oh. In a uh, wow, you know, in uh, it's like became waste, like, like how in a forest, suppose you cry in a forest, nobody is listening, nobody is hearing. Then, if you cry, what did you use? You know, like that, it became wasted. You know? Uh, there was no change, not even a trace in the consciousness of Aridas Thakur. Then, third night, when he started ending, Aridas Thakur, she started telling, Ye Mahasai. Huh? You, for three days, you are giving me wrong, wrong assurance. You are telling me lie. No? You are giving me wrong assurance. Uh, as soon as you finish your round, you told me you will fulfill my desire. Uh, but day and night, you are, you know, you are they're doing Nam Sankirtan. 
so that means what your commitment are not at fulfilled then ardash thakur is telling what i can do the the role that i made how i can break it down see we have to learn from this we have made a rule we have taken a vow i will chant so many rounds is it not we should not break it okay this is what we have to learn from ardash thakur he says i made a rule but how can i break it then hearing that you know i uh, hearing that determination understand hearing the determination of aridas takur that is saying then what this lady is telling prabhu o oh master i am the maya devi see i am the illusory potency of lord krishna maya devi i am come here to take to to test you even brahma ji the i was capable of even defeating brahma and everyone but today i got defeated by you <laughs> you know i got defeated by you then maya devi is is telling i was not able to even bring out even a trace of uh, transformation in your mind in your consciousness you are a mahabhagavat by your darshan and then by hearing you by your krishna naam shravan you know by through your thing hearing krishna and shavan my consciousness has become pure now i'm i'm having a strong feeling to do arinam please have mercy on me please bestow me arinam to me uh chaitanya avatare बहे पेमा मृत वन्या सब जीव प्रेमे बसे पृथ्वी है लदन्या ये वन्या ये ना बसे सेई जीव चार कोटि कल्पे तबे ता नाई कनिष्ठार श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु when when chaitanya mahaprabhu appears in this world then this whole world will be inundated with what prema amruta you know like when the heavy water comes up right like uh, last time last month or two months ago vrindavan <laughs> yamuna was all flowing right everywhere you must have seen wow, amazing you know like that chaitanya mahaprabhu's time the whole world is inundated with prema you know water of prema huh? uh, the amruta nectar of prema you know uh, inundated uh, so so the partner jiva who can immerse in that they will get uh, prema huh? uh then the whole earth becomes danya danya no uh, most fortunate fortunate huh? uh then if a jiva cannot cannot get chance to inundate in that prema amrut then it is a worst waste of his life you know crore you no know, billions billions of kalpa imagine billions of kalpa one kalpa is dev brahma okay billions of 
Bah, Brahmas. Days like that, then such an unfortunate jiva cannot cannot get auspiciousness. So long time back, uh, I have obtained Ramanam from Lord Shiva. You know. Uh, but today, by the association of you in my mind, I've been I'm greedy for the Krishna Nam. <laughs> okay. I got Ramana from Lord Shiva, but now I'm having a greed to obtain Krishna Nam after listening to you. So for liberation. Sarka Brahman Ramanama. No, Ramanama is huh? taken birth for liberation. Uh, meaning by Ramanama you can get liberated. But Krishna Nam Paraka. Paraka Paraka. Okay. Ramanama is Paraka Brahma is a Krishna Nama is Paraka Brahma, meaning Krishna Nama is not just satisfied giving you liberation, you know, <laughs> it won't get become peaceful. It gives you Premadam, it gives you love of Krishna. So please have mercy on me, please give me Krishna Nam, make my life successful. Uh, by that, let me also get inundated in this, in this uh, inundation of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's you know, love. So, say saying, Maya Devi started paying obeisances to Aridas Thakur. Then, uh, Krupa Sindhu Aridas Thakur. Huh? Uh, then he gave Krishna Nam to Maya Devi. Vishwa Vimohini Maya Devi. Uh, see, Vishwa Vimohini. He can, whole world he can finish. <laughs> Such a Maya Devi. She got defeated by Aridas Thakur. Uh, how, oh, like uh, Sparshamani, you know, there is a Sparshamani meaning touchstone. By touching a, a low iron, if you touch, if you get touched by Sparshamani, touchstone, what happens? It turns into gold. Same way, Maya Devi, by the association of Sadhu Sangha, Ardhas Thakur. She gave up this boga lalasa. See, we have these three enemies. <clears throat> boga lalasa, meaning in, enjoying. Want to enjoy, he did that. Siddhi lalasa. All these subtle things. Oh, gold, you know. <laughs> then mukti lalasa, liberation, these three things. Give up, you know. She gave up all that. Then she started singing Krishna Nam, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna. Became very happy. Uh, she was so happy and then she left away. So, Sarvendriyake Dwara Krishna Nushilan Karnevale Par Mayakrava so we are saying, Nishkapata, without duplicity, and then without aparada, okay? Two things, without duplicity, and then without any offenses. If we are continuously chanting Arina, then such a person, huh? 
no disturbance possible no disturbances can come nothing in this world can disturb them uh -huh. this is a true like swayam maya devi came and then could not do anything So, it says, Shuddha Bhakta Nitya Krishna Bhogya. Shuddha Bhakta is eternally Krishna Bhogya. He is to be enjoyed by Krishna. We are chanting, Shuddha Bhakta, pure devotee is chanting or what? To make Krishna happy, understand? To make Krishna satisfied, to make Krishna enjoy that. You know, if he, he enjoys <clears throat> his own name, try to understand this. We should have that feeling. When we are chanting, Krishna is enjoying, he is listening, he is feeling happy, he is blissful. You know, that is the power, you know, Krishna's name itself is. So, if we in that mode, then how we can be overcome by Maya, you know? Maya is not Bhokta. Maya is not the enjoyer. See, Maya is not the enjoyer. Right, Ramesh? Maya, they yourself is a servant of Krishna. You know? Maya Devi is a, you can see this, shadow potency. Swarup huh? Shakti is huh? Chaya, shadow. And Swarup Shakti is not <coughs> enjoyer. Krishna is the enjoyer. He is the servant. Right? So, uh, that's why in Gita, Bhagavan, Lord, what do you say? Maya he is telling for Maya, Mama Maya. Uh, meaning, Mama Maya, Maya itself is also meant to be enjoyed by Krishna. So that's why such a person, when one who takes <coughs> surrender to the Lord, then he will easily cross over this Maya. Huh? So, Lord Vishnu and Vaishnava. Vishnu and Vaishnava, they are Maya Tita, beyond Maya. You know, they don't come under Maya, nor Vishnu nor Vaishnavas. Huh? Srila Aridas Thakur, uh, he he brought it out in this world, in this Leela. Uh, when someone with all his Indriyas, all his senses, uh, if you are following Krishna Dasya, servitude to the Krishna, uh, no matter how much Maya, you know, Maya Devi, the illusory potency can do all the tricks, okay? <laughs> uh, uh, then all our tro trouble will, what happen? What is this, something like that? It will be useless. Like, for example, suppose, Himalaya is there, big mountain, right? Big mountain. Can you break that mountain with one small stone? You throw one small stone at <coughs> Himalaya. 
and anything can happen nothing <laughs> like that the power of entire maya devi cannot do huh, for such a uh, vaishnava you know all his senses engaged in service of krishna so So in this in this incident, uh, Chaitanya Charitamrita, Krishna Das Kaviraj is telling Maya Devi, Sri Laridas Thakur, she obtained mantra, huh? Krishna mantra. Some people think, oh, it is impossible. See. People think like that. Uh, so they don't trust like that. But Krishnadas Kaviraj is telling, I'm I'm having a strong faith in this. You know, uh, if you hear this, you will also obtain the faith. Uh, Whoever listen to this, everybody will, will have their faith increased in this. It has really happened. How? So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, when he descended, people became Lubda. Uh, Krishna's frame, Lubda. You know, they desire their. Uh, you know, Lubda meaning what they they want to obtain, you know, greedy, huh? Brahma, Lord Shiva, Sanak. Then they all appeared on this planet. Then they obtained the Krishna Nam. They started dancing. And they were got inundated in the frame. Love of frame, you know, this uh, inner inundation. Huh? Narada, Prahala, Lakshmi, uh, Krishna, frame obtaining that Manisha in the human form of life, you know, in, in the body of human life, human body, they appeared on this earth. Then they started tasting this prayer. So, what to speak of others? Sakshat, Swayam Krishna himself, Ranjendra Nandan, to taste that prayer, he came in the form of Krishna Chaitanya. So, See, Krishna himself came, Shiva, Brahma, Lakshmi also came. Then, what, what, uh, what is uh, so uh, astonishing, if Maya Devi also came and asking for this Diksha, begging for this Prem, what is so, you know, uh, Asharya, meaning so astonishing about it. So th that's why there is nothing like astonishing thing. The reason is with the mercy of the great personalities, huh? without the mercy of great personalities, no one can obtain the love of God. Krishna Prema cannot obtain. Without mercy of Mahat Purushas, mercy of Mahapurusha, he has it. This is what Krishna Rastagra is telling. Uh, so, Jai Aridas Thakur ki Jai, Maya Devi ki Jai. <laughs> Uh, 
See, that's why Chaitanya Mahaprabhu at the end, you, you probably send a photo, you know, at the end, he desired uh, He himself gave Samadhi to Haridas Taku. Haridas Taku, uh, his desire is there. How he is telling, you know, Lord, I know you will disappear soon. Disappear soon. You have come and finished your. Thing, but I have that desire. Please forgive me for this. You know, I would like to. I cannot tolerate separation from you. Suppose tomorrow you disappear, I'm still living. I cannot tolerate. <laughs> no, no. That's why I would like to live before you disappear. Please fulfill my desire. You know, he's saying that. So, hmm. so he's telling, Oh Lord, fulfill my desire this i want to leave then see lord is also bound by the desire of this so i cannot say no then uh, hmm. Then what happened? Uh, uh, so Bhakta Virahmi, huh? see, Lord also feels separation from Bhaktas. No? See, this is a thing, you know. See, about the gopis, see. Why gopis are crying? You know, Krishna is in Mathura, Dwarka. And here gopis are crying. Why then? They say, Abhi, no. <laughs> no one is crying for you, Krishna. That's why we are crying for you. Is it true or not? You know, who is crying for Krishna in Mathura or Dwarka? Tell me, anybody? Or anywhere in the world? Everybody wants the help of Krishna. See? Help of Krishna. You know, they want to... Blessing from Krishna. All these things are there. Okay? But actually, actually, no one is crying for Krishna. Only gopis, only in Vrindavan, Yashoda Maya Nanda Maharaj. Especially Radharani. Huh? They are crying. Nobody else is crying. You know. So that's why Krishna, you know. Someone is crying for Krishna, I tell you. He will cry for us. You know. We are not crying. You know, that's why our Gurudev is keep telling, cry, cry. For what? No, I want this. I see sometimes the ba baby cry for mother. For what? Hungry. The baby is crying for mother or for itself. You understand? Suppose the friends are there, you know them. Oh, crying, crying, crying. 
they want something from you if you cry that is selfish okay that is not what you are talking you know go gopis are really don't want anything the gopis want anything from krishna no nothing what do they want they want him to be happy that's all they don't want anything from him you know they have given up everything given everything which is impossible to give up they have given up. and try because why he is alone <laughs> he is not happy <laughs> nobody is doing proper service to him see radharani left like the other day we were telling huh? radharani left rasalila for what oh i am not able to fulfill his desire that's why he has gone to somebody else he has gone to so many unlimited gopis she and me she got frustrated on her own see not that she is envious or anything like right? so even radharani herself trying so much to fulfill the desire to make him happy not oh. so in this world or other than vrindavan okay <laughs> it is a problem everybody wants to be happy at the cost of krishna directly indirectly this is what it is okay so maya you know that's why in vaikuntha also what is there mm -hmm. krishna is not happy that's why krishna is not does not take up his like the way he appears like a covered boy he is because he is not happy and he has become very like narayan very opulent why because people other you know followers of vishnu they want to be opulent like him but he himself is not interested but if he himself does not put on a, a show like that then they will think oh no he is not <laughs> you see what i'm saying i don't know you got it what i'm trying to say you know lord vishnu is also not happy <laughs> but he is putting on a show so that others will be oh you see how opulent lord vishnu so that way they will also feel enjoying the opulence like that so to give them a company but himself is not he is not happy because krishna is is putting a show you know he is like a, he is a, he dressing himself as a vishnu you know he is not interested you know to make them happy see this is the austerity <laughs> krishna in the form of vishnu is an austerity for him to please other devotees like in the dwarka you can see mathura is in a very austere for krishna you know he has to fulfill their they want to happy this way that way so many wives children they are happy in that but krishna himself that's why gopis are telling acha time ho gaya acha mata ha huh? so my time is up and so uh, it's getting early dark already huh? so krishna is happy he is not happy in any form okay <laughs> any he is only happy in vrindavan you know you get what i'm saying so that's why the gopis huh? now so aridas thakur is telling you know i cannot talk so i would like to the Ah. 
Then Mahaprabhu is also very merciful. So he gave okay to the desire of Aridash Thakur. Uh, then Aridash Thakur keeping Mahaprabhu in front of him, opening two eyes, huh? looking, having darshan of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu through his, through his eyes. Then he established the lotus feet of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in his heart. Uh, then tears in his eyes. Sri Krishna Chaitanya. Sri Krishna Chaitanya telling, you know, my no, he gave up his like Bhishma, he gave up his body. So then all the devotees inundated by the bhajan, huh? by Kirtan. Then Chaitanya Mahaprabhu became very uh, taken over. He took the body of Aridash Thakur, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Then he started dancing. Uh, then, after that, his body was brought to the seashore. Uh, then they bathed him in the sea water. After that, they, you know, seashore is all lot of sand. They, they dig the sand. Huh? Uh, then they put Aridvastakur's body. Then I am Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself taking sand and putting on the body of Aridvastakur. Huh? Uh, so this way, Aridas Thakur Samadhi was finished. So, because the Samudra, the sea, touched the body of Aridas Thakur, the Samudra, the sea also became Mahatirtha, you know, holy place, Maha, very big, Maha, huh? holy place. Uh, then Aridas Thakur, you know, Samadhi, taking Parikrama there. Then they, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself went taking arms, begging for the, um, celebrate his separation. Uh, then Swayam Damodar, no? Swarup Damodar Goswami, he took all Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, whatever he collected, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself collected, took that, uh, you know, he, he didn't want him to, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu carry that. Uh, then, he was, all the devotees were fed from that thing. You know? uh, then Chaitanya Mahaprabhu gave blessing. To One who takes darshan of Arjas Thakur's Vijayosava, then they have danced in it. Our kirtan. Then we have given the sand. Uh, our one was taken prasadam. Uh, then Krishna will be fulfill their desire. 
Hmm? You will give love of Krishna. So, Sri Krishna, by mercy, you know, he gave me association of Haridas Thakur. Krishna is Swatantra Ishwar. And by his desire also, he gave me, he separated me from Haridas Thakur from me. Uh, so when Aridas Thakur desired to go to Bhagavad Dham, I don't have strength to keep him back here. So by his own desire, he gave up his life force. Huh? Just like Bhishma Pitamaha, how by his own desire, huh? he was able to give up his body. So, as long as Aridas Thakur was on this earth, he was like a very amazing so, shiromani. Huh? Now, earth has become lost that beautiful jewel. Then Aridas Thakur ki jai, Aridas Thakur ki. Uh, Jai Aridas, Jai Aridas. So Aridas, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu started dancing. So this happened. Like today is the like remembrance, you know, of disappearance of Aridas Taku. So we pray at his lotus feet. Yang Marciana Aridas Taku ki jai Arinam Sankirtan ki jai Chaitanya Mahaprabhu ki jai Jagannath Puri Dham ki jai Aridas Samadhi ki jai Aridas Bhajan Kutur ki jai Thai Gaura Prima De Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Please sorry today our question and answer I could not get time. Uh, and also it's getting late and yeah so we will make it up next time till then please forgive me for my indebtedness Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 